welcome to Brigantine Living Live. I'm your host, Leslie, joining you not from Brigantine. I'm actually on my honeymoon, but we have some amazing segments coming up for you this week that I could not not introduce you to. First of all, I wanna do some shout outs to our public works. I know we had some snow last week. I ate my words. <laughs> Um, and they did a great job at keeping our streets clean. So thank you to Brigantine Public Works. And I want to thank you for tuning in and turning on Brigantine Living Live wherever you are on your Saturday mornings, especially um, those of you who did the uh, clothing swap last weekend. Krista sent in some photos of you guys watching. That was awesome. Thank you so much for tuning in. I am going to deliver whatever I have <laughs> written down in my notes on this resort envelope. Congratulations to our Brigantine Community School scholars. They were invited to present their STEAM program at the New Jersey Association of School Administrators Texpo 2024 conference. You see why I had to write that down. But they have a really robust, amazing STEAM program and they presented their hydroponics, coding, circuits, and their community projects. Great job, guys. I'm so proud of you. This is really amazing life experience that you're getting, getting the confidence, learning how to do all of this stuff. Love it, love it. So we are closing up January already. Usually I know January goes so slow, but I feel like, I don't know, maybe it's because I've been counting down for this honeymoon, but I feel like January went a little quicker. February is coming up and we have the big game. We've got all these uh, Valentine's Day stuff happening. Finally, events are happening. If you are looking for things to do, I know Shore Space just released an entire calendar of workshops and events. You can check that out on their social media. I have Brunch with Babes Galentine's edition coming up on February 18th in Galloway. Today, if you're looking for something to do this afternoon, you're going to head over to Bob's Garden Center right offshore uh, in Egg Harbor Township on the Black Horse Pike. They're doing a really cool terrarium workshop today at 3 p.m. Coming up next, we have a really cool segment. I actually went out on the beach with a group called the Polar Collective. They are cold plungers. My friend Sadie is there kind of guiding everybody through what it's like. So I interviewed them. We had some first timers. You're gonna check that out. And then we have our friend Scott Nearing from Holiday Architects and Ralph Busco from Allison Paul Builders with a brand new segment that's gonna be airing every single month on our show and they're gonna be taking you through what it's like behind the scenes of building your dream beach home. So there, I've been learning a lot just from filming. There's no palm trees there, but if you are looking to build your dream beach home in Brigantine or at the Jersey Shore, they work all over, you're definitely not gonna to wanna to miss it. All right, don't go anywhere. We have some words from our sponsors and our really cool segments. Ciao, neighbors. Indulge in the taste of Italia without venturing too far. Visit Brigantine's very own Casale al Mare. Experience freshly grated cheeses, oils and vinegars, imported pastas, and enjoy a handcrafted drink from the espresso bar. Follow them on Facebook to stay up to date on upcoming events, weekly deliveries, seasonal products, recipes, and so much more. Casale al Mare. In the journey of life, finding balance is key. Welcome to Hello Wellness Counseling Services, here to support you on your journey of healing to wellness. We understand that everyone's path is unique, and that's why we offer a wide range of services to support your mental and emotional health. We are here for you every step of the way. Visit HelloWellnessCS.com. Brigantine Living Live. We're now here with a brand new segment called Behind the Scenes with Allison Paul Builders and Holiday Architects. In this segment, we're going to learn about things maybe we didn't know before. We're going to answer some frequently asked questions and we're going to break some misconceptions. So now let's get started. Hi, I'm Ralph 
Ralph Busco from Allison Paul Builders. Hi, I'm Scott Nearing from Holiday Architects. At the beginning of design, it's important to understand what types of foundations there's going to be. There's two types that we build in Brigantine, and that's a slab on grade foundation and a crawl space foundation. What this does is it dictates the height above grade. Um, with a slab on grade, you can build at elevation 12, which will give you more floor to floor heights, where a crawl space you're going to be at 13 plus feet and reduce the floor to floor heights. Basically going off what Scott said, every lot in Brigantine, there's, there are different elevations for different lots in Brigantine and also different sizes. So essentially the beach is about five to six feet higher than the bay. And sometimes when you get closer to the beach, you will definitely use a uh, slab on grade. And as you get down towards the bay, you will probably use a foundation and a crawl space. Uh, certain areas you need pilings. And uh, depending on where you are on the island does change. Uh, one thing is consistent. Uh, the roof height will be the same all the time from 35 feet. And also the first floor, uh, if it's not a slab, it'll be at 13 feet above sea level or the slab will be at 12 feet above sea level. So with relation to the foundations, whether you set it at a slab on grade or crawl space, typically you can get a nine foot ceiling, an eight foot ceiling, and then an eight foot wall height with a slope up to 10, 10 and a half feet. And, and that's the house that we're in now. Um, so the goal is always to maximize the upper floor where the living space typically is, which will allow you more space and width depending on which way the roof lines go. And we definitely have to keep an eight, nine, and 10 uh, only because you don't want to go over the building height of 35 feet, which we mentioned before. And we try to get to 10 foot, obviously, like what Scott said, to get more uh, higher doors, higher windows, more light inside the third floor and an open concept. So once we have the foundation types, the floor ceilings dictated on each level, when you get up to the third floor, we try to maximize the space so you have an open living concept, um, which is also dictated by the roof pitches and the heights that Ralph spoke about earlier. So it dictates how wide you can go with the house with the required roof pitches. So a lot of times we'll have a, a center gable going through the house and then we'll turn certain aspects in order to maximize the space. And the ceiling heights will go up into that roof system. As you can see from an open floor plan, you have to try to create a dream in about 30 feet wide here. So we have a fabulous kitchen behind us. Uh, Scott designs these homes with a bar the kitchen, fireplace, and also you'll see in a second the views of water. That's the reason why we have the open floor plans with the upper windows, transom windows, uh, floor to ceiling, obviously some windows floor to ceiling, bigger doors. Uh, this is the gathering room. This is where most of the people uh, today are, you know, now spend all of their time. So in the summertime, people are here. When the water goes dark, you still have a beautiful home on the third floor, and from certain parts of this house, you'll also see the Atlanta city skyline. Ciao, neighbors! Indulge in the taste of Italia without venturing too far. Visit Brigantine's very own Casale al Mare. Experience freshly grated cheeses, oils and vinegars, imported pastas, and enjoy a handcrafted drink from the espresso bar. Follow them on Facebook to stay up to date on upcoming events, weekly deliveries, seasonal products, recipes, and so much more. Casale al Mare. In the journey of life, finding balance is key. Welcome to Hello Wellness Counseling Services, here to support you on your journey of healing to wellness. We understand that everyone's path is unique, and that's why we offer a wide range of services to support your mental and emotional health. We are here for you every step of the way. Visit HelloWellnessCS.com.
Hello, Brigantine. It's Leslie Jesperson. It is a crisp, uh, chilly morning on the Brigantine Beach. I would say it's about 50 degrees. I haven't checked the official temperature, but I'm getting ready to go check out a group of people, some of them that I call friends, who are diving into the water, calling it cold plunging. So come on, let's go check them out. I usually just walk into like waist tight and then slowly sit down. So you want to get the back of your neck submerged if you can in your shoulders. If you have problems with your fingers and toes getting cold, keep your hands out of the water. You can wear booties or gloves. Like the idea is to keep your body in. If your cold hands and feet get you out before your body's ready, ready then wear gloves. Like just me a preen. And keep a hat on, yeah. And you can dunk if you want. It's a, an extra rush, but you don't need to do that. How are you feeling about your first cold plunge? Nervous, but excited. I'm excited to see if I can do it. I actually feel really good. It wasn't as hard as I thought, and it definitely takes a lot of like brain motivation to get in there. But once you're in, it wasn't as bad. It was not as bad as I thought. I'm freezing now, though. <laughs> Can you do it again? Absolutely, yeah, absolutely. Fires up part of our brain that's been dormant. When we, you know, when we lived outside and we had to survive, it's kind of a survival thing, it's more than anything. Um, so it's actually, and you feel like, like I'm energized now. Like yesterday I did this and like all day I was on fire. And the first time I did it, um, I've been doing the cold showers and doing the breathing for a while now. But um, the first time I did this with Sadie and all these people, nice people here, at 11 o'clock at night, I was still dancing. Like, With Holiday Architects, you are enlisting an experienced team to create a home you can make memories in for generations to come, whether you're starting from scratch or need renovations or additions. Exceptional design tailored to your unique vision. Holiday Architects.